The Ministry of Youth Development and Sports is collaborating with a major player in the sport of basketball to heighten and sharpen skills here on island. We have Ryan O'Brien with a report. An initiative to develop the sport of basketball in St. Lucia came up for discussion here recently as the Vice President of Organization, Culture and Inclusion of the Toronto Raptors, John Wiggins, met with a number of officials to look into the requirements that will be needed to allow this to happen. Wiggins, whose parents were born and raised in Grosley, said the discussion was a follow-up on an initiative started five years ago to see how young enthusiasts can get more interested in the sport and to bring more basketball exposure, teaching and development to the island. Crucial to achieving this is the aspect of infrastructure and that includes the possibility of covering the VG Malibaba Sports Complex and to bring it up to NBA standards. The meeting was to find out where we are with laying the groundwork and how we figure out a way forward how people are going to come together, both the ministry, the federation, myself, how we can set a foundation for the NBA to come in here and bring programming and enhance the infrastructure of basketball. It's a great sport. The kids love it here. And St. Lucia, the West Indies, and the Caribbean are being targeted as the next hub for basketball to grow throughout the world, especially by the NBA. So this was a follow-up to see where we're at and how do we move forward. Kofi Dovo is the director of Tropical Studio Designs Architects. He was present for the discussions, which took place at a conference room at the Ministry of Youth Development and Sports. It's very possible to cover the, the VG multipurpose um, court. Um, the option that is being explored right now is to use a steel frame, um, almost like a, a factory shed, you know, to make it simpler. Um, the alternative of using the, the, the steel frame, I mean, with a truss covering, is to be able to gain large spans. Okay, so it's suitable for, I mean, um, sports arena. Where we are now is that based on what um, the Vice President, um, Mr. John Wiggins, discussed in the meeting is that that may not necessarily meet the standards of NBA. So now what we want to do is revisit and look at how we can create a more um, desirable, you know, setting, okay, that will, you know, be okay with NBA so and it's a process that probably cannot be done in one go so it has to be a phased approach so what we're going to do is go back to the drawing board and look at how we can phase that and make it you know possible. Dovo said all things being equal the covering of the codes can be completed within 8 to 12 months from commencement of works. From the Ministry of Youth Development and Sports I'm Ryan O'Brien.